I've got my first Armenian cucumbers and lemon cucumbers. You can see the Armenians over here. Pretty long and skinny. Probably be good. You could cut them in half and uh, well, maybe thirds and put them in canning jars. See another smaller one starting to get larger. Doesn't seem it's making a whole lot of them, but maybe that'll pick up as it gets, you know, throughout the summer. It's pretty hot now. It's about 90 degrees in this greenhouse and more when the sun hits it. I've got a lot of large brown Russian cucumbers looking really nice. And then I got to pick some of these lemon cucumbers that have turned into a, an orangey yellow lemon color. And I sampled a couple of these. They were actually really good. They just have a, a decent sized seeds in the center, what you would expect, but a good amount of flush and uh, pretty tender. I just ate them with some salt. I did notice that the leaves were starting to yellow a little bit, probably from lack of nitrogen. And so I went ahead and gave all the lemon cucumbers and Armenian cucumbers about a quarter cup of chickadee doo doo, which is pelletized chicken manure. And just top dressed it and then used the sprayer on the hose to work it into the, the top of the soil. And then everything over here in the brown Russians, I used about a quarter cup of bone meal, which doesn't have as much nitrogen, but it's pretty dense and potent. So it'll probably work just as good. Maybe even some better results because of the, the added phosphorus. You can see I made a little bit of a mistake though in here. See all that white splotchiness? That's what's called powdery mildew. And it's pretty common on melon and cucumber leaves when things get too humid. It's rained cat and, cats and dogs for the past few days here. And then it was really hot in the greenhouse and I thought, well, you know, everything's wilting a little bit, so I'll just spray it down with some water and cool it off. No, you don't, you don't ever want to spray your leaves with water. You always want to water at the soil because all that extra humidity and moisture on the leaves let that mildew set in. And same, same would go for any of your cucurbits or melons in the field in raised beds or whatnot. You always want to water them at the soil and never spray water, water them unless you're doing like a fuller feeding or something like that. But I'll probably sample this big Armenian today. I've had them before, although the the variety I had before had a bit more of uh, ridges going up and down. This kind of looks a little bit more like a zucchini, but we'll have to see how it tastes. I'm sure it tastes good though.